Right now at 12.30, a new pilot program is taking aim at one of Milwaukee's biggest issues, reckless driving. Thanks for staying with us this afternoon. I'm Pete Cervakis. City leaders rolled out that plan today. Our Ben Jordan live on Milwaukee's south side with how it's targeting certain dangerous intersections around the city. Ben. Pete, that pilot program is being called Take It Easy Milwaukee. They already have their branding in place with these yellow buttons. They're going to have signage all across the city with this message on it over the next three months. Meanwhile, MPD will address Milwaukee's reckless driving problem by focusing on four intersections that are notorious for the problem, like this one right here. This project is a public and private partnership. That means a few businesses have offered money to support the campaign. Others are providing free advertising on billboards, yard signs, and MCTS buses to inform the public of the project. Starting in August through October, Milwaukee police officers will focus on these four intersections by providing extra enforcement, and they plan to collect data on what they find. Now, these are the hot spots aldermen often hear about the most in regard to reckless driving and red light running. Here's Common Council President Ashanti Hamilton. We really want to, to, to give you the visual that there's no section of the city that's not impacted by reckless driving. It's every section of the city. And uh, Chief Morales was also here today. He talked a little bit about this program and the enforcement side of it. He didn't share specifics on how many extra law enforcement officers will be focusing on these intersections, but he says the data will show for itself after October. Reporting live on the South Side, Ben Jordan. Today's TMJ4.